Further rain in New South Wales is certainly not what's welcome, but there is still some of that around in the forecast. This strip of cloud here producing some heavy downpours, edging ever further north and eastwards. For the moment, New Zealand, though, with high pressure, it is dry. And there are showers and thunderstorms scattered about across northern areas there, into Darwin, for example, mostly during the afternoon. A few showers for eastern parts of Queensland. Some heavy downpours, though, the further south you are, though on Monday just beginning to push away from Sydney, but the darker blues indicating that could still be some fierce downpours towards Brisbane, for example. Melbourne and Canberra just isolated showers at this stage. You can see that zone of wet weather, though, stretches down to New Zealand, South Island. So after a settled spell as we go through Monday into Tuesday, that's going to be pushing its way ever further north. Perth, though, is hot, but it is dry. By midweek, it will cool down a little bit in Perth, and that cool down comes with a few showers before temperatures head up again later in the week. By Tuesday, you can see that wet weather covering much of New Zealand's South Island and into Queensland. There are some heavy downpours towards the north. What about the forecast? That's a cool down in Perth, maybe a passing shower on Wednesday. Occasional showers and thunderstorms continue in Darwin, especially during the afternoons, and heavy rain clearing to showers in Sydney.